Okay, so not having it with Damn Demo Day. This is a new series that I just thought of. And instead of me playing the games that I have during the week, I will uh, scroll Xbox Live and uh, PlayStation Network and download a demo, either a high-profile demo or a random demo, and I will critique it. Today we have uh, Driver, the new Driver game. I think it's Driver 3 or some shit. This game, um, I don't know whether you played the old Driver games, but... Um, uh, man, what was it? You play as a undercover. I don't. You played as an undercover cop in the old ones. It's probably still the same shit. I don't know. But as I was reading the uh, mission, you, the main character, the guy that you play, his name is Tanner, and he, um, he has a near death experience, and it gave him the ability to, you know, transfer or warp or, huh transfer his himself into other people so he can control them and when I read that I was like this is gonna be some bullshit it actually turned out to be fairly fun it'll get old pretty soon right now I have to uh, shift is what they call it I have to shift into the jackass the jackass is the card that I'm following who cut me off in the beginning and they actually call him the jackass I'm not just making that up right now I've shifted into the jackass and now I have to jump off of a um, I have to jump off one of those uh, transport trucks that you know transport the cars to dealerships or wherever the fuck they take them so that's what I'm doing right now um, at right right from the beginning I noticed that the controls in this game are I guess they're pretty realistic because the faster you go the harder it is to control it. that's gonna take some getting used to the controls themselves are really easy to pick up especially if you're used to playing racing games they're not bad um, the graphics look okay uh, the uh, the main character and his partner when they were talking in the car and you'll see it throughout that looked pretty good um, the environment looks it's okay it could be I don't know it, it's okay like the shading and the lighting that looks pretty good uh, the other cars look fairly well they have really good uh, licensed cars so I like that uh, what I don't like, and I don't know whether this game will be rated M or whether it will be rated teen. What I don't like is the fact that if you speed off of, if you go off road and hit the, and you go on the curb, um, no matter how fast you're going, everybody miraculously gets out of the way. You are unable to run over anybody, and I'm not some type of maniacal psychopath that just loves running over people in video games. I just think that you should really have that in the game, you know, especially if you're going for the whole realism, uh, the whole realism aspect. And I don't like to skimp on realism in video games. I don't like it when uh, developers do that. It raises, uh, it, it makes me raise an eyebrow and give a look of disapprovement. Other than that, uh, I like the uh, the damage of the cars. That's ah, damn it. That's not really realistic either, but it's apparent. So I will uh, give them kudos for that. Um, who makes this game? Damn it. It's a it's a well known uh, developer too, and I saw that name and I can't remember it now. Ah, uh, fuck it. Whatever. Right now, what I'm doing is I'm chasing the cops. I mean, I'm <laughs> chasing the cops. The cops are chasing me, and I have shifted back into the jackass. And now I have to uh, get away from the cops. It takes me a little while. Uh, but enough about this game. I don't know whether I'll pick it up or not. I, I probably won't. Um, unless it gets like really, really cheap. It supposedly has over 200 missions. And you're in San Francisco and it's an open world environment. A la Gran Turismo. Not Gran Turismo. Um, Grand Theft Auto or... I don't know whether you'll be able to get out of the car. I know in the old drivers you could get out of the car, but I don't know whether you can on this one. So it would be more like a, a burnout maybe, something like that. 
anyway, like I said, I don't think I'm going to pick up this game unless it's really cheap or it gets really good. I'm going to I'm going to continue to play this demo. They give me uh, they gave me two other two other missions, and I'm going to play through them and see if that sways my interest a little more. Maybe it'll uh, I don't know. Maybe it'll entice my appetite. I don't know. Anyway, uh, yeah, this is uh. But this is a new segment. This is a new series in my YouTube channel. Uh, damn demo day! Just, I'm just gonna go ahead and download some demos, and I'm gonna play them. This actually saves me a lot of money because demos are free, and I can download as many as I want as long as I can fit them on my hard drive. So, with that being said, let me let me know what you guys think about this new series, this new idea of mine. And uh, give me some feedback. Uh, of course, as always, um, I ask you guys for a small favor. If you watch the video and you indeed like it, um, please take a, a, a second out of your time to click the like. Uh, if you watch uh, a lot of my videos and you appreciate them, uh, subscribe and drop me a comment. Let me know what's up. Uh, this video has just got about 10 seconds. Uh, I appreciate all the support that I'm getting from everybody, and I'm going to keep it up. I'm not happy.